guys, what's up Taurus? Thanks for watching, appreciate it. We are going to look at your current love situation. We're going to see what's going on around things, what the desires are. We're also going to look at um, what's working for you and anything that's working against you right now. Also the outcome. So remember, oh, remember that the energies can be reversed. Also remember it's a general reading. So just take what's yours, leave the rest behind. If it does resonate, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. And if you'd like to contact me for a personal reading, that is below as well. All right, Taurus. It's almost like the energy of uh, typing and erasing, typing and erasing. Someone wants to say something, but they don't know how to say it. It's in a positive way. It looks like you've been actually doing a lot of healing and things like that. Um, Okay, for some though, I mean, you could just be kind of chilling and have options. All right, so your current situation, you have the Justice card, the Libra Energy, the Page of Swords, the Two of Swords, the Eight of Wands, and the Two of Cups. <laughs> okay, so um, it doesn't feel like it's like something or a conversation or anything like you're rushing straight towards or like it's it's that energy i was talking about like somebody doesn't know how to say something or or kind of like start the conversation and actually it's interesting because communication is actually what's coming in as working against you but it seems like that's okay because it doesn't feel like somebody wants to communicate anyways for the desires but it's the energy like it's opposite the other side falls opposite so you could go on either side of that this is all about working something out and creating harmony but that desire is you know to kind of just observe see where things go it's not a lot of communicating back um and then for what's working again or for you excuse me you have the two of swords which is so interesting because the eight of wands which is communication and messages is what's working against you you have two 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 here which is great for um you know love romance partnership somebody coming back that type of thing uh you can check out my short on that let's clarify this show me the justice card i'm willing to waver that's what i just heard all right so anyway sorry show me the justice card you got that four of swords um there could be a legal situation for some that's going on Show me the, uh... okay, so you got the Justice, the Four of Swords, the Nine of Wands, the King of, or sorry, the Nine of Swords, the King of Wands. That's fire energy. Um, it does look like there's like, there was this healing element, but this energy, the King of Wands is stressing, worried, nervous, like, hey, so it makes me think this is the energy that's like typing and erasing. Because it does look like this is somebody that you, there could have been an age difference or somebody made a choice, but somebody pulled back. Now this King of Wands, again, not the type of energy that usually stresses. The King of Wands was, is confident, kind of a leadership type of energy. Alright, so show me this Page of Swords for Desires. You get the Death card, Scorpio energy. Show me this uh, death card, please. Oh, no, no, no. Too many. It has the energy, like, at least the feminine, possibly uh, keeping a lot in, not really saying anything with the death card up there. And the fact that, like, the communication is pulled back, it's more of a change, create change, transitional, like, transform possibly within self you got the knight of pentacles that's your energy the desire is to take it slow and it it honestly feels like at least one side is kind of that 
transitional and moving forward energy. Show me this two of swords for what's working for Taurus. So it, this is like completely backwards of what I usually say, but um, the it's almost like the not the the less you say, the better. Um, like be more of an observer decide where you like which direction you want to move in make a choice and kind of take action take your time because what's working for you is is planting seeds so to speak it's you know uh taking time for contemplation and, and allowing time allowing things the time to manifest because with the seven of pentacles that's like a garden it's like planting these seeds and you wait for something to kind of take it to, to, you know, it's not an overnight quick energy. But what's working for you is, I think, um, because we go from the two of swords to the two of wands, healthy choices, healthy decisions, and kind of like being aware and start putting time and energy into the, the direction that you want to move in. Show me the Eight of Wands, please, for what's working against Taurus, which again is communication. You got the Chariot, that's Cancer energy, you could be dealing with the Cancer. I think the, the Star Aquarius energy, this over here is good, but... It's in general good energy, but it's kind of opposite of over here. It's like not rushing, not, um, you know, kind of taking your, your time. I, I don't think communication necessarily is a bad thing. I think it's all about like the speed in which things are kind of like occurring. Like it's, it's almost like a don't rush things. This is a very quick energy because you do have something coming towards you that you're wishing for that you're hoping for and it does take time like it's it's like the things we want the most like they don't just happen like that they happen over time and that's what's coming towards you and that's it's that's like the energy of like worth waiting for show me those two of cups please for the outcome for Taurus. You get the Two of Cups, the Nine of Pentacles. Um, the Nine of Pentacles is a card of being single, but it looks like right now you're kind of just taking them one day at a time, putting time and energy into yourself. I think you are kind of taking action, but you're going, you know, at your own pace and doing a lot, getting a lot of self-growth and elevation also. Um, taking time for introspection, reflection. Um, kind of going within and, you know, setting your attentions, being honest with yourself, examine like the way, what you want in life and the direction that you want to head in. I think over here, this is, you know, it's, it's a, it's a nice energy, but it's also a very, um, quick moving energy if you do meditate or anything like that really focus in on um, the throat chakra would help right now but it does appear the divine timing is at work all right Taurus I hope this helped if it resonated, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. If you'd like to contact me for a personal reading, that is below as well. You guys take care and I will see you next time.